Hey everybody, my name is Gunnar and welcome back for another video of Humankind. We're gonna continue this series, boys. Having a lot of fun playing this game for you. Uh, obviously, we did pretty well in the last video. It's actually a, sh a, a little bit of a longer video because we actually have some events popping up. Uh, we entered the medieval era, so uh, third, the third era in total. So now we're well above everybody else, uh, which they all basically started their classical era. Even the fifth faction haven't even started the fact it's still in the ancient era. So uh, we are doing fantastic compared to them. Uh, also, we got some brand new ships. We got our own navy and everything. So everything's doing fine. We are also about to create our third city. So let's do it right away. Uh, let's actually let's use an arbor first off we can build an arbor so we might as well do it right away uh while we're at it they're telling me to go for this one so i guess i'm gonna listen to them yep your first let's build an arbor, arbor right here so we got an arbor Fishing, trade voyages of exploration you will see many things out of this tiny window onto a huge world all right so we got an arbor but we and we still now have enough points to build ourselves a city so let's do it boom just like that, we got our brand new city, boys. We're going to attach to Lich. Boom. And just like that, there we go. So we got our auto outpost. Now we are attached perfectly. We got 18 points uh, of influence, but we're gaining 112 points of influence per turn. Uh, with that, we are definitely going to put some people into the population and stuff. That's really going to be important. I can only have three population. Okay. Uh, got you. Well, in that case, I'll just put people into science for now. And um, I've, I can only have three and I can only, only have two out of five. Okay, got you. Got you. No problem. And we're also going to do procession over here. No problem. With that, uh, that's going to allow everybody to to chill a little bit. We are going to do that. That one. Definitely going to do a mar uh, luxury market. Boom. Just like that. That is done. Uh, naval unit spawn. So we can uh, create it at the... Uh, arbor or this place i'm gonna just keep it at this place i guess for this city uh they're both together i guess and we also have some arbor so we can build arbors at the wazoo really uh first off though what we want to do is definitely build up a bunch of like uh, all the little uh things that we need so fishmonger definitely want to build all of them so first off gonna make sure that they equip the money mod all right so while we wait for the money uh, to appear boys we'll just uh skip a little bit we're gonna we're gonna send our warriors right here we're just gonna keep them moving actually yeah i'm gonna keep them moving towards there that's gonna be a little bit faster if i do that also i'm gonna start moving up my naval units so my naval my navy and we got a civilization right here actually we have a civilization boys in another continent we can see the borders right here so we might come across our first civilization so yeah i still don't have money what's going on with that is it going to appear the next turn all right it might appear the next turn boy so in the meantime uh while that is being completed i guess i'm just gonna go for watchtower palisades what all right so i'm gonna go for palisades for now i guess we're just gonna work on that while everybody everything else is getting worked on uh, over here in Korma, everything good. We're still working on the research quarters, so we're good on that part. We don't have anything else to do right here. One guy in industry. I don't want anybody to be in industry. Uh, already maxed out in science. It's just going to put somebody in the food or somebody in the money. Definitely want to put somebody in the money so we gain a little bit more even. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's pretty much it, boys. Uh, we need we're gonna need 172 influence points in order to attach this outpost to this city but we're not we're not gonna do that because we're gonna actually detach this one eventually we're gonna create that that's gonna be our other city right here so we're definitely gonna do that uh, next up don't have anything else yeah I think uh, think we're good to go boys we can skip or oh, we have to re uh, choose a research though standing army or trade expedition so we can get naval transport oh i need that that's what i was trying to do is getting the naval transport we're gonna do trade expedition big time so we can actually get our troops into the ships that would be a uh, great wouldn't it so yeah we just need one more territory we're gonna uh get uh Aristar. so let's skip the turn i don't know if the mods for the money 
they don't seem to be working boys unfortunately so if they're not working it's kind of frustrating a little bit because that's a lot I'm missing on right now we are gaining population though and I guess I'm just gonna quickly build that yeah I'm gonna quickly build that palisade at least the palisade is done so we got some walls over here over the city uh, next up as well we what do we want to do I guess yeah I could get some stone walls Get some stone walls, but don't want to do that right now. I, I need to focus on the big stuff. If, I, if only the mod was working for the money, man. It, would, it wouldn't create any problems for me. That's kind of frustrating big time. Let me, let me build on the fishmonger, boys. We need to build on that. Uh, we have a new civic that's available. Br uh, lots of new civics. We got three civics we can choose in total over, over time. We're getting less influence now, though. Don't know how that's happening. Really don't. We're going to do procession over here because we don't want anything stupid to happen. Uh, uh, also, we want to in the industry guy to be into science big time. And uh, we also want we want to start working. Instead, we want to start working on the Levi administration. So getting more money done per turn. Definitely going want, to want, want that to happen. Uh, we want the same thing so we stop working on the research get the industry guy into the money and also we're gonna get uh working on the levi administration all right that uh that's complete i guess that's perfect it's gonna take one turn to do the levi so at least there's that also my armies just gotta keep it moving uh, keep them moving i guess towards uh there eventually the, they'll come by we're gonna be able to join them together so let's keep uh my navy going they're gonna go right here we're not gonna we're, we're seeing some more land and we just uncovered a new territory right here boys there it is brand new continent right there i'm not ready to face it though i'm not ready to to get that uh that one just yet we gotta wait on that one a little bit further don't know why the mod isn't working though for for the money it's really is frustrate it's fr frustrating but we're gonna in the meantime we're gonna just choose our next one i guess it's gonna be standing army it's gonna uh, give us iron resource cd watch so some garrisons i guess and swordsmen that are going to be available uh to us let's end the turn boys and enter turn 35 all right so we're getting a lot of money i mean a lot of money but it's not enough for turn to really quickly purchase what i wanted to purchase we got kerma population gain in the pada as well so both these guys gained a, an extra population um i guess since we're maxed out in there yeah i i want to keep uh so uh, food wise want to keep having uh, more people available and also uh for this city right here our brand new city we have enough money to quickly purchase the fishmonger we ha also have a need to start working. Oh man, we're not producing any food per turn. That is bad news right there, boys. Not producing any food. We need some farms and stuff. I got to get working on the money wise, I guess, over there because there's nothing else I can do. Let's just do the fishmonger. The fishmonger is completed now. We quickly build that. Uh, I guess we're going to keep start working on the food uh, system and stuff. Definitely want to start working on that. We're going to buy out with... I don't want to do that, boys. Okay, I'm, I'm going to wait it out. We're going to do Granary. Might restart the oh, uh, my mods really quick just so they work properly. Because without the money, I can't do anything at all. So, uh, we've got the, uh, the Levi administration right here, which is great. Uh, we're going to keep working on money. I, I want to gain more money. Uh, also, we're going to start working on palisades over here. So we're going to get some palisades done. As you can see, I really love the fact that this is well fortified. You can see there's walls across the city itself. Well protected and everything. I love to see that. And also, how much does it take? How much will it take now? 530 points of influence in order to get ourselves another city, boys. That is quite a lot. That's really a lot, boys. Uh, so our next civic, how much did we need in order to? We need two, 319 points. It didn't seem like that last time. I guess so. 319 points. All right. Well, we're gonna focus on getting our our civics done. 
for this uh, for these turns, boys, because otherwise we're never gonna get anything done, really. So we, uh, I want to focus on my civics first off, uh, first and foremost, and I think that's the best option to do uh, to go for right here. Ships just continue to go right here. Doesn't seem like they're going very far though for the ships. We would think they would be able to go like cross more channels and stuff like that uh, faster, but I guess it's not the case, I guess. All right, so we're gonna end the turn. We're gonna enter turn 36, boys. We got standing army that's researched. Perfect. And we got a new wonder that can be claimed as well. Uh, for the wonders themselves, I mean, I can start working on Wonder. That would be great. That would be a great option. We can go for Rhetoric, Conquest, Craftsmanship, Mounted warf Warfare. I'm gonna go for Holiday the Library Theaters. Let's go for the Rhetoric, boys. Let's go for the Rhetoric. Uh, what do I want to do here? What do I, what do I want to do? Because I've got 31, uh, 300 and, uh, of influence, over 300 of influence. I'm gonna show unclaimed wonders, so I'm gonna try and claim one of them. I did want to have the Colossus, so I wanna get the Colossus. I'm gonna claim him. So let's claim this wonder, boys. So we got the Colossus. There we go. So I'm not too sure where we're gonna put him. Where do we where do we put the Colossus exactly? Okay, I'm not too sure how it all works out. But I guess now we can we claim him, so now we can probably build him. Is that how it's going? Oh yeah, that's how it's working. So now we can build him because, okay, we, uh, we got him. Okay, got you, got you game. So now we can actually go for him. Uh, Nepala, Levi Industry, it's gonna take about four turns. I'm gonna let them uh, let them do their thing over in the, uh, Nepala. I'm actually gonna quickly purchase the granary right here. So we actually build up some food. And uh, we can put uh, somebody else into food right here. So we're definitely going to do that. For food, it's just so we need, like, start getting a lot of food um, done real fast. We also need to get working on uh, lots of money, uh, money-wise, I guess. The food as well. I need to get working on all these food things. So let's just start working on those. That should be uh, good enough. We got also our armies, so uh, my ships right here, they're crossing by. I really need my armies, though, to get there fast because they're not getting there fast enough. Okay, so this is as far as they're going to get. Maybe next turn we're going to be lucky and they're going to be able to enter the place. Uh, can we actually attach this? We're, we're not going to be able to do that. All right, boys, so it worked this time around. Managed to restart my mod, so I actually get the money. So now we're going to be able to build a lot of stuff. We're actually going to get the money. About damn time because uh, that was getting scary a little bit. We're going to enter turn 37 as soon as the game duh, starts break, uh, stops breaking apart. Okay, so there we go. We're turn 37. We can start building up stuff. And now we're at 200 in of, of influence. We're getting a lot of influence per turn, which is definitely something we want uh, to happen. Uh, we can start working on the Colossus, which I want to work, to be honest, right here on this brand new city that we've got on the shores. I want to work on it right here. So uh, I want to get it somewhere where like very far away. So I want to get it right here, right here. And uh, oh, that's going to take a long ass time though. Okay, no. So I don't, I cannot do that. I cannot do that right now. That's going to take too long. I need to start working on... Okay, so yeah. First off, I need to work on all these things right here. Stone walls, palisades, all these things. Watchtowers. There we go. Uh, let's get food market. Levi administration. That's a lot of money. Uh, we're losing big time right here. It's costing a lot of money. Uh, aqueducts. Big time. And house of science. All right. All of these things have been built. And now my city is going to be fantastic. It's going to be doing good. Uh, the thing is, um, now, can I actually yeah, put one more guy into science? And that's going to be fine. Uh, next thing we want to do right here is now we can start building uh, on this guy. So let's start building him up. We're going to need some help though, because 47 turns is quite a lot. It's a lot, boys. Over here in Korma. 
Uh, we can start building on him, helping them out. So we're definitely going to do that. We're going to help out on the construction. It's going to take 13, uh, 13 turns. Like 47 of population. I do not want to waste that. Um, we are going to spend this guy. We're going to send them over to food production because we need some people to... We need to gain more population per turn. Uh, and what about our, our city over here, uh, Nepada? Nepada, just get the administration real quick. And get the stone walls as well. So uh, just so it's done already. There we go. So perfect. That, so that is done. And we're going to start... Everybody's going to start working. Every single one of my city is going to work on the Colossus. So it's done uh, once and for all. So we don't need to worry about it afterwards. And we're going to send uh, one of the population over the food. All right. So that is completed. We uh, have enough points to maybe enact. Well, we don't have enough points to enact to see, uh, enact uh, any civics right now. But uh, we are getting close to that point. Uh, we are going to get right here. We're going to go right here with our ships. And you are going to go right here as well. And you're going to actually enter. Kind of want to enter. Oh, they can only enter on the, these ports right here. Okay, got you, got you. So they can only... They got to go here, I guess. Okay, so my ships are going to have to um, enter via this uh, part of land or something. Pocket of land, which is uh, quite interesting. So... Uh, if you can see, if you look really quick, 9 of population already for this city, for the third city, 11 for Nepala, 12 for Kurma. Kurma was hit big time when I decided to, uh, like, spend a lot of my pop actual population that I w uh, had in order to uh, quickly build some stuff, you know, in order to quickly get uh, some of them uh, to build... Like, uh, not wonders, but other stuff, like special uh, special buildings and all and such. So my third city gained a population. Great. Army lost at sea, so units in the land will be destroyed next turn if they remain in deep waters. Not good. Rhetoric uh, research, boys. We can get theaters, libraries, and hol holiday, uh, or holy day right here. Let's go right here. There we go. We do not want to lose that army. And uh, right here. Can I embark? Okay, what if I go here? Cannot be done as there's not enough free slots as targeted. Oh, got you. So I actually have to... I, I need one ship. Okay, I need to separate them. I don't want to have three ships. Oh, I got you. I know how it works now. Okay, got you. So I'm guessing what I have to do, boys, is I gotta get rid of one of them. Transfer. All right, forget it, boys. You know, we're just going to forget it all together. And we're just going to move our ships together. We're just going to discover the new land via that. I guess we're just going to forget it. I don't... I really don't know how we're supposed to... To just simply go into the sea. Uh, I'm guessing it's just doable ourselves. We can just create our own ships or something. I don't know how it works. Uh, next up, what do we want to go for? One of these three right here. So mounted warfare, craftsmanships, or conquest. Conquest is going to give us some gains, which we definitely want to have. So Nepada, it's eight more turns in order to get the um, get it going for the Colossus. Eight more turns. Uh, we could try and quickly purchase right away the all this stuff that we just got, but we're going to wait on that because I really want to focus hardcore on the. On the Colossus and all. And once that all of that is done, really, we're just going to start focusing big time. I'm just going to send this guy over to food production. There we go. And we're going to start focusing big time on creating a second army. A second full army. Somewhere. Wherever there's more population to be lost, really. We're going to do that. Uh, over here, didn't gain any population. That's fine. Kurma is uh needs a procession to be happening and industry wise we need more people in the uh in the food industry for sure all right so that is all good and good, uh, done with almost have enough almost have enough how much is it for another city 530 so another two turns it would be uh it would be fine so i'm gonna wait another two turns i'm gonna save my points unless i want to go for civics boys could try and go for civics right here but it's gonna be yeah would take at least another turn 
Yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna wait it out. I'm gonna wait it out. We're gonna do merchant though, because we have plenty of resources. We're gonna do merchant this one right here. Merchant on this one, boom. And now we gain some more extra money from that. That did spend some of our influence in order to do that, boys, but that is uh, fine by me. We enter turn 39. We have in danger, uh, an in danger, uh, one of our, we have one of our armies in danger of getting lost into the sea. We're going to actually send them all together because I want them to move and I want them to move into the next territory. So the start moving Maui. there and brand new civilization, Science, boys. And culture. The only Natural wonder as well. Are those elephants? All right, so trespassing, you're not allowed to trespass on the people. Matter of diplomacy. So now we're going to start doing the, uh, our first diplomacy, uh, diplomatic actions. The Morians, boys, we're interacting with them. We can go into the sea with uh, my units. Okay, I got you. So we can actually go into the sea with my units. These guys, I'm just going to keep moving them forwards. We're going to move them back into the land so I can upgrade them. Uh, next up, I know that I got over in Nepada though. I got a guy for the industry, which I don't want right now. So I'm just gonna, I'm just, I'm gonna do procession, and I'm gonna send them over to the food. Obviously, we want to get as many food as possible. Another eight turns, okay. And uh, for you, you didn't gain anybody. And what about you, Kerma? Kerma, you got. Nobody did you didn't gain anybody you're doing you're doing fine as it is. Okay. Got you. All right So now we're gonna actually interact Interact with uh, these guys uh, unless I want to get the civic first. So independent peoples Religion tolerance land rights independent people. What is that mercenary armies or? This uh, assimilated people so assimilate cost the cost for the hiring an army is I'm going to do mercenary we'll army, boys. There we go. So we're going to do mercenary army. The next step would... It's 500 allies. influence points for the next step, boys. It's it's a lot. It's going to take a while, boys, before getting the other uh, uh, civic. That's for sure. And uh, next up for me is really to get my fourth city going. So we're going to uh, save all of our points for that. Okay, so let's see. So this is the guy we need to talk to. Uh, we're just gonna we're gonna start talking to them really quick. We're gonna interact with our uh, for the first time with another civilization. All right, so Elisa, as long as welcome, welcome, my girl. Let's see what we got right here. Um, we're pretty friendly to each other. Export, import. Do I run an import? I want to kind of export because I've got all these strange resources that I don't know what to do with them. Uh, I kind of want to import on them, so. Let me try and export. I want to export those. And also, surprise war? Nope. Proposal and alliance? Not really. Right now, we're just gonna maybe try and do the share maps things. Only trade luxuries? Uh, we can try and trade luxuries if you want. Do you want to trade luxuries? Things change. They do. All right, there we go, boys. So, I we're trading luxuries with her. Which is uh, great. We can share maps, try and share maps eventually as well. Maybe, you know, that would be great. So for now, we're just trading. Uh, we, we could get some uh, mercury. I can buy those for sure. Should I try and buy some mercury? Let me buy some of that for sure. Uh, buy some mercury. There we go. Buy that. That would give us so, so 72 gold. To buy that, that doesn't cost anything. Transportation mod, mod price, yes. There we go. So we get we bought we bought some of their mercury, boys. So resources sold, and that is purchased. That that is done. That is done. So we buy that, and uh, we get some mercury. Perfect, boys. That is fantastic. So with that, we're actually gaining another type Almost of a resource, a resource, and we gain a little bit more knowledge of their territory, which. Tail. I mean, they've probably got their entire, this entire continent seems to be uh, um, up to them. Seems to, just like us, uh, uh, belong to them and stuff. That's, uh, that's kind of crazy if, it's that, if that's the case. Let's enter the turn 40. Uh, culture chosen for the Syrians. Okay, they entered the classical areas. Area. Uh, Conquest researched, so we can get games going, and uh, we can get uh, outpost assimilation as well. Perfect. 
not that type of guy that really is gonna go into war stuff uh, do any types of wars or anything boys we're just gonna keep it simple we got a new civic available as well so still another six turns before we complete uh the other things so if we go into i mean i could try and continue to work on the money but i feel like working on the food is the most important thing right now so we're just gonna keep working on that just wait the six turns completely there's a guy right here what is that uh to ganarians the morions have a special interest in this place so they want possibly possibly want to trade with me or something which i'm more than happy to oblige on that part if uh, if it comes to that i'm already maxed out in science over there so i could uh definitely go for uh, food again let's keep going for food uh we're gonna be fine on that part and we got 146 points so we'll just keep saving our points at this point we should probably create another outpost before they come in because now they know we're here they know about this land we're probably gonna try and land the thing is i'm gonna need this is where our fifth city is gonna come by boys this is where fifth city is gonna come by so i don't want to settle anything right here just yet just gonna keep moving towards the uh these locations and with these guys once we're in the territories we're gonna uh modify them or upgrade them and we're gonna attack the knocks are on our north uh borders the mounted warfare craftsmanship let's do craftsmanship there we go and uh, for the next part we don't have anything else to do and uh, we only have our ships that we gotta move and i want to uncover as much as possible so we're gonna uncover the land as much as possible and before entering because i do want to have some sort of treaty non-aggression pack uh i'm gonna accept i'm gonna accept the non-aggression pack i don't want to be at war with them i feel like we want to be friendly with them we both have our uh continents separate continents so we can be friendly to them no problem uh and uh also i don't really want to do anything else no no everything else seems fine by me so can i actually ask for a treaty right here i can't all right, well, I guess in that case, I am trespassing though. I am trespassing. So I'm just going to stay away from their own borders and do my own thing. Just to, to prevent myself from like pissing them off. You know, I don't want to piss them off or anything. So we're not going to trespass. We're not going to be stupid about it. We're going to keep it quite simple. All right. Well, I think that's it for today, boys. We're going to save it for today. Uh, remember to leave a like and subscribe and enjoy the video. See you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.